A big thanks to Napoleon Grills for sponsoring this episode. I'm Pitmaster X, and today I'm gonna use Parmesan cheese to make the most delicious chicken wings you've ever had. Of course, you're gonna need the written recipe, and it's on pitmasterx.com, so go check that out after the video. Personally, I love Parmesan cheese. I love cheese in general, but Parmesan cheese is like a good old Dutch cheese. It's like one of the cheeses that the Italians did right. And that's coming from a Dutch guy. And we're like pretty serious about our cheeses. And there's one person that likes cheeses just as much as I do. It's not the dog, it's Morrison. So everybody's freaking out here just because there's Parmesan on the table. And I'm going to try and make it through this whole video and not be eating the whole Parmesan before we get to the recipe part. One more piece, one more, one more for you. There you go. And one more for Morrison. Can we get started? Stop eating my cheese. No, 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 no more cheese. The rest is for me. I want some too. Mm. So for the recipe, I'm going to take two garlic cloves, chop fine a whole lot of parsley, and I'm gonna use some free range chicken wings. If we take a closer look at the wings, you see that these wings consist of two parts, the drumette and the wing. Normally you would also have the tip on here, but I have no use for my wing tips. There's almost no meat on it and it's probably gonna burn anyway. But I do like my drumettes on the wings because if you order wings solo, you get only this little part and this is just more and more is better. Now I'm gonna add two tablespoons of olive oil to the one and a half kilogram of chicken wings. Then I'm gonna press in the garlic, add the parsley, add some salt, add some ground pepper. Then I'm gonna grate in two sticks of Parmesan cheese and I'm gonna add four tablespoons of breadcrumbs. While I'm hustling up these ingredients, I wanna make sure that the Parmesan cheese sticks to the chicken. We want it to form a layer on the outside. So we're gonna go gently, make sure to pack it on. Time to put the wings on. But this is kind of an experiment because we need to go low and slow. So I'm going in between the burners here. Well, I'm gonna let that chicken sit in between the burners that are on. So that's basically over indirect heat because we want the cheese to melt and we want the meat to caramelize. I'm gonna close the lid and let the hot air do its job. It's sitting over indirect heat. We're getting the hot air up. The cheese is gonna melt. It's gonna be so delicious. Wait, man. In the meantime, we're gonna make a dipping sauce to go with it. First step is putting some olive oil in a pan. Once the oil's hot, I'm adding one diced onion, one fine chopped garlic, and three fine chopped rabbit peppers. We're gonna fry this until they turn soft. When you're frying, it's of course important to have enough oil in your pan. You wanna make sure you see that bubble going on at all times. And the oil is also important for the sauce that we're making out of this. Before the garlic starts turning brown, I'm gonna add a can of diced tomatoes. To that, I'm going to add a tablespoon of dried oregano, 100 milliliters of chicken stock, quarter tablespoons of salt, and some fresh ground peña pepper. Now slowly let the tomatoes turn soft at a simmer. And once that's done, you end up with a beautiful dipping sauce. Finally, they're done. And it's like, it's like making chicken wings. It's too easy. Anyone can do it. And like, there's no, really no challenge to it other than you gotta cook it. And of course you wanna make sure you get the temperature right. So you wanna go above 75 degrees Celsius core temperature on your chicken wings. But besides that, it's way too easy. And, and you know it, if you wanna know all the details, it's in the recipe. But look at this, beautiful chicken wings juicy, tender, just shreds up. What I wanna know for sure 
is how did that Parmesan crust taste? What's more important? Chicken, I don't know. Chicken or cheese, what's more important? Mm. Wow, mm -mm -mm. that's a discovery right there. That is a tasty chicken wing. Uh, Parmesan, like, really crunched up together with the breadcrumbs and of course the garlic. It's heavy on garlic, but I love that on my chicken wings. So. On one hand it's Italian, on the other hand it's barbecue. Just like we need more. Now let's try that sauce because you can have a great chicken wing, but in my opinion you're gonna need a sauce. Sooner or later you need it and of course we got the most beautiful dipping sauce there is. This is like almost like a salsa you find to go with your nachos. So. Mm. Mmm, wow, it goes so well together. It's almost like, like a pizza, and, but also like it's spicy. It's like Mexican food. That is an absolutely fantastic combination. The Parmesan cheese with that sour salsa, it works so well because that Parmesan cheese is creamy and rich and that salsa has an acidity to it that's really, really tasty. Mm. Crunchy, texture, flavors. This has everything you need. You think, should we give it one now? Yeah. And now, whoa. <laughs> she's so aggressive with chicken. So aggressive. She's so aggressive with cheese too. She this knows what she's doing. I, I wasn't believing you when you said, it's, it's a mild salsa. It's a mild salsa. It is a mild salsa. It's like a good dipping sauce. Yeah. Like having this for a, like a barbecue, oh, a barbecue competition, like a game. No. Game day uh, eat a snack like that. Yeah, um, oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Perfect. You can have salsa, you can dip your chicken in it, nachos, Doritos. Chill out. We're still eating. Like, we only had one. You're already on your second one. Mm. And I love the crust. Mm. I like the crust of the Parmesan, but I do agree it's like, if there could be more on it, it would be better. Next time I'm adding more Parmesan chicks to ch chicks. <laughs> Parmesan sticks to the chicken. Mm. It's absolutely fantastic. I hope you guys like this recipe. I, I did. I, 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 if, if you don't try it, I don't care. Like, it's okay. I'm not going to judge you for it. Yeah. This is literally too easy to make, not to make. No, this is so easy. You could make. make this on a Tuesday. Maybe not on a Monday. No, not on a Monday. But on a Tuesday? Definitely. Mm. Yeah. Can you, you can even can make this. Yeah, at home. Uh, what do you do? Sorry lady, excuse me. I think we should finish up the video before the dogs yeah. start eating us. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give us a big thumbs up and a comment down below. Uh, throw us some other chicken recipes as well. Yeah. If you have any ideas. Or suggestions what suggestions. we need to make next. Yeah, yeah. So um, big thanks to the patrons and the YouTube members. Hope to see you guys next time. Until then, eat smakelijk. And keep on making Parmesan chicken wings. Yeah.